Hey guys, um, welcome to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a laptop into a desktop computer. So the first thing you'll need is a screen or a small TV of some sort and if you're using the small TV you'll need an HDMI cable pick these up at Walmart for like ten dollars and so f the first thing is you're also going to want to have an extension cord because the plugs on the TVs aren't that long so I'm gonna go ahead and plug in the extension cord and plug this into the cord Well, I've got the wrong extension cord. I'll be right back. I'm back, and I got one of these. See what you can do? Is put this into one of your power cord. And then it has a extra thing here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Just simply plug it into the wall and then have your cord and plug it in just like that. So now your TV has power. Next thing you want to do is connect your HDMI cable with your computer. So I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. Let me just open the HDMI cable. So I've opened the HDMI cable, and most computers come with this, and they come with this capability, so say you have a small computer, and you want the screen bigger and the keyboard bigger. This is what you would use. So this is a four foot one, it's about $10 at Walmart, and it does what I need it to do. So on most computers it's on the right side and you just simply take this and you put it into the computer. It's almost like it's basically a USB thing or a charger. So you take it out, you put it in. It's just really easy. So then where you're gonna you wanna put your computer behind the TV where you can't see it, like back here. Then just take the other end of the USB and put it into the TV, like that. And voila, your computer is hooked up to your TV with an HDMI cable. Now it's time for the keyboard. So, this keyboard I have already opened, so I'm not going to time lapse it. This keyboard is also, I got it from Walmart, and it was about the same price. It's by the same company, so it's just your standard keyboard. It's a pretty good size. So let me go ahead and open the keyboard cord. Alright, I opened it and the cord is uh, three, three, maybe four feet long. It's really good. So what you do is take your computer here and basically just plug this in to one of the USB things like that and snake the cord around like that and now you have your keyboard done as simple as that so now you'd have your keyboard the thing we're looking at is your mouse now I would um I would 
recommend having a wireless mouse, but um, a mouse with a long cord would it also do good. This tutorial has been um, a tutorial about how to make a desktop computer from your laptop. Subscribe, like, and see you next time.